This is why I don't fucking talk to nobody. This is why I bring my ass to work and take my ass motherfucking home. That's canceled. <laughs>
is now after 10. I'm annoyed. When it hit 8 30, I was like, let me delete his fucking number because I'm gonna text him some out of some out of pocket stuff and we we're gonna get into it. Cause I'm like, if I have his number, I have the opportunity to say something out of pocket. So let me delete his number so I don't say anything. And I've been dealing with him off and on for so many months. It's just like annoying. It's like so annoying. Like I don't even know why I keep doing this to myself. We are bound to repeat our mistakes until we learn the lesson. Honestly. And I, I think that's what I'm going through. What I don't understand is that I told him, I was like, listen, when you do that, when you say you're going to do something and you don't do it and you don't follow through with it, that literally breaks my heart when you do that. And he's like, I'm sorry, blah, blah, blah. And you know what it is? I expect him to be a better person than he actually is. I expect more out of him and he's just he's just a piece of shit honestly the only good thing about this is that it never gets far enough to the point where i make a mistake if you know what i mean I really try to keep it like light and do what's good about my channel is that i can be relatable and being relatable means being vulnerable and being vulnerable means saying what other people aren't saying which is you know i got i got hurt and i think a lot of us have that one person that can literally take our mood like from here to here. Oh. Oh. oh my god. Mm. Mm. We got through it, didn't we? You're a star. I'm on my way to being successful. All I gotta do is be consistent, you know? Okay, and the highlighter that I'm going to use with this is the Master Chrome Highlighter. This is just such a bomb highlighter, bro. Literally shouldn't have chugged that wine, like. It is, I'm feeling like warm and zigzaggy. <sighs> okay, focus. What do I do for my lips? Do I just use Cyber? I'm gonna go in with Cyber from MAC. This is the first and only lipstick that I've ever bought from MAC. Um, I really wish I had a lip liner. Let me get into what I don't like about this lip color. One, it's very transparent. If you walk out of the store without purchasing Night Moth, the lip liner that goes with this, you're basically fucked. Your life is over. We're gonna take it off. Look, it's literally coming off so easily, which could very well be a bad thing. Eat something and boom, it's gone. Don't eat fried chicken. Don't wear Cyber on Wing Thursday. I'm just gonna do that three lip, that three color combo again. Um, it's gonna be Lolita, Plath, and Hudson by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I really thought I wanted to do a goth look, but pff, bitch. Okay, so what I did was I added more like volume to my lashes. The eyeshadow was overpowering the look a lot. But that's it for this look, like that's literally it. This is nothing like what I had in mind. Um, it is different. Have a good one. Wait, um, I'll see you in my next video.